Hey YouTube, I'm going to show you how to make a meme using some software I bought called Affinity Photo, which I'm using as a replacement for Adobe Photoshop because Adobe Photoshop costs too much. I have a file here on my desktop that I'm going to open up. And I'm really not creating a meme. What I'm creating is a title for a YouTube video. So what you want to do is you want to select Layer, New Layer, and you want to select the Text Tool and you want to change the text to impact and the size. This is a rather big picture, so I'm going to say 144 and I'm going to start typing. And the color of the text is wrong, so I've got to flip these. I don't know why they're not flipping. I'm going to do this. I want, I want to flip those. I'm not sure why they're not flipping. So there's white. Now they're flipped. White is on top, black is on bottom. Rocky Mountain Sherpa Fun. I want that centered. And probably could go a little bigger. Now if I right click on the layer and choose layer effects and go to outer shadow not enabled close I'm not on the right layer if I go back and click on the text click on right click on it click layer effects go to outer shadow and what I want is the opacity up to 100% the radius can be certain number of pixels and then I want a high amount of intensity so now you can see that the text is looking kind of like I want I might go a little higher and this offset will give it kind of a 3d look if I increase the offset so that looks pretty good to me that's what I want then what you have to do is export this file if you do save or save as, it's going to save it as an Affinity Photo type file. And what I want to do is save it as a JPEG and that's all perfect. So here we go. I'll call it meme, save it to my desktop. I think it's done. I go to my desktop and look for meme.jpg. There it is. Perfect. So that's all there is to it. Now, in case you're wondering, this is what I'm actually doing with that, is on my channel. You see how this video has, he has a shock locked out, LOL. I don't want that. What I really want is to go to Video Manager, go to Edit, go to, see none of these pictures are really any good. So I want to go to Custom Thumbnail and Desktop and choose me. Now that's uploading. And now it's done. And you can see what it looks like small. It looks better than even some of these other ones that I've done that too. See, this one doesn't have anything, nor does this one or that one. And it would be nice if they all did. Thanks for watching.